Have you ever stopped to ponder why living in the present is so crucial? Let's explore the captivating world of mindfulness, a concept that holds the potential to revolutionize our lives. Picture embarking on a journey not through physical space, but through the labyrinth of your own mind. This journey is about discovering the beauty of now, the magic of the present moment. Mindfulness is more than a buzzword or a trend. It's a voyage into the depths of our consciousness, an invitation to embrace the here and now. It's about acknowledging each moment as it unfolds without clinging to the past or fretting about the future. Imagine your mind as a serene, tranquil lake reflecting the world with clarity and tranquility. This is the gift of mindfulness, a mind unburdened by the shackles of past regrets and future anxieties, a mind that dwells in the richness of the present. But don't just take my word for it, let's delve into the science behind mindfulness. In the realm of neuroscience, mindfulness has emerged as a powerful tool for mental transformation. You might be wondering, how does something as simple as focusing on the present moment have an impact on our brain? Well, the answer lies in the magnificent adaptability of our brains. A property known as neuroplasticity, scientific studies have shown that mindfulness practices can actually rewire our brains. Just as a musician might develop certain areas of the brain through constant practice, so too does the regular practice of mindfulness change our brain structure. When we engage in mindfulness, we strengthen neural pathways associated with attention and sensory processing. This means that our capacity to focus improves and our perception of the world around us becomes sharper, more vivid. It's like turning up the dial on your life's resolution, suddenly seeing things in high definition that may have been blurred before. Furthermore, mindfulness also enhances our emotional regulation. By focusing our attention on the present moment, we can more effectively manage our emotional responses. Instead of being swept away by a sudden wave of anger or worry, we learn to ride these emotional waves with grace and resilience. Moreover, mindfulness has been shown to reduce the stress hormone cortisol. It's as if each mindful breath we take is like a soothing balm for our nervous system, calming our bodies and minds. The practice of mindfulness also increases the density of gray matter in the brain, particularly in areas related to learning, memory and emotion regulation. Imagine that, by simply paying attention to the present moment, we can boost our brain's capacity for learning and emotional intelligence. So you see, mindfulness is not just a spiritual practice or a relaxation technique. It is a powerful method to enhance our cognitive abilities and emotional resilience. It's like a personal trainer for your mind, strengthening and sculpting your mental muscles. Each moment of mindfulness is like a workout for the brain, enhancing our mental faculties, reducing stress and improving our overall well-being. But how does mindfulness manifest in our daily lives? Let's take a simple example. Consider the basic act of eating. When we eat without mindfulness, we often barely taste our food. We're thinking about our next task or scrolling through our phones, disconnected from the experience. But imagine transforming this everyday act into a moment of mindfulness. As we sit down to eat, we pay attention to the colors and textures on our plate. We take a moment to appreciate the effort that went into preparing this meal, from the farmer who grew the ingredients to our own efforts in the kitchen. We then take a bite, savoring the flavors, the textures, the warmth of the food in our mouths. We chew slowly, appreciating each sensation. This is mindful eating. Suddenly, a simple meal becomes a symphony of experiences, a moment of gratitude and joy. This is the power of mindfulness. It enables us to connect deeply with the present moment, transforming even the most mundane tasks into enriching experiences. Now, imagine applying this mindfulness to other aspects of our daily lives. As we walk, we feel the ground beneath our feet, the wind against our skin. As we work, we focus deeply on the task at hand, losing ourselves in the flow of the activity. As we interact with others, we listen with full attention, connecting more genuinely with them. Mindfulness is not about emptying our minds or achieving a state of eternal calm. Rather, it's about paying attention in a particular way, on purpose, in the present moment, and non-judgmentally. It's about noticing the world around us, noticing our own thoughts and feelings, but not getting swept away by them. When we live mindfully, we wake up to the experiences that make up our lives. 
We don't just rush through our days on autopilot. Instead, we live fully in each moment, savoring the richness of our lives. And so, mindfulness is not just a technique, it's a way of living, it's a way of being in the world, a way of relating to ourselves and others. Mindfulness enriches our everyday experiences, allowing us to live more fully and richly. It's a gift that we can give ourselves, a gift that can transform our lives. So why not start today? Why not bring a little more mindfulness into your day? Furthermore, mindfulness serves as a powerful tool for mental well-being. It's like having a secret weapon in the depths of our mind, a beacon that guides us through the tumultuous sea of thoughts and emotions. Instead of being overwhelmed by the waves of worry, stress or fear, mindfulness allows us to approach these emotions with curiosity and compassion. Picture this. A thought or emotion is like a cloud passing through the sky of our mind. Mindfulness teaches us not to cling onto these clouds, but to observe them with gentle attention, acknowledging their presence but not letting them define our entire sky. This practice of observing without attachment is profoundly liberating. It frees us from the cycle of reactive thinking and empowers us to respond to life's challenges with a sense of calm and clarity. Remember, every cloud, no matter how dark, will pass. And with mindfulness, we can navigate through them, finding peace and balance in the midst of life's storms. This practice of observing without attachment allows us to respond to life's challenges with a sense of calm and clarity. But mindfulness is not just an individual practice. It has the power to transform our relationships and communities. When we are present, truly present, we engage with others on a deeper level. We hear the unspoken words in the silence, feel the emotions beneath the surface and understand the thoughts hiding behind the eyes. This is the power of mindfulness. It fosters empathy, understanding and genuine connections. Mindfulness is like a silent symphony orchestrating a dance of compassion and unity. It's the key that unlocks the door to a world where every interaction is meaningful, every connection is cherished, and every moment is filled with profound understanding. To summarize, mindfulness is not just about being present, it's about appreciating the present. It's about embracing the ordinary and finding the extraordinary. It's about turning every moment into an opportunity for growth, for peace, and for connection. I invite you all to join me in this beautiful journey of mindfulness, to embrace the art of being in the present, and to witness the transformative power it holds for our minds, our lives, and our world.